I've been flying for about four years. When I first flew in a glider, I was about 13 years old. I got into flying because my grandfather was a pilot and then my father was a pilot. Every great flight starts with a great toe. So we take off and we're connected to a tow plane. It's a Satabria and the rope is about 200 feet long. We went up to about 2,700 feet above sea level and the airport elevation is 1,100 feet. The glider itself has a glide ratio of 36 to 1. It weighs about 1,000 pounds with both of us in it and its wingspan is 17 and a half meters. I describe the ground as being the ocean floor and all of the air being the water, the currents, the wind, and I think it feels like swimming. My highest glider flight on an excellent summer day, I made it to about 10,000 feet and I've gone about 120 miles in distance. I've never hit anything in the air except for a great thermal. When a thermal forms, part of the ground is hotter than the surrounding ground, so that air rises faster, and that is what I circle in. Soaring is flight in its purest form. When I'm looking for thermals on a hot summer day, I look for birds because they find it before me. I soar with turkey vultures, red-tailed hawks, bald eagles. When I turned 14 years old, I soloed the glider, and then when I turned 16, I got my private pilot license for the glider. I had my pilot's license before I even had my driver's license. I love flying gliders and powered aircraft, but I prefer gliders because I can use nature's energy to fly. Sometimes I feel like I am one with Mother Nature. Thank <laughs> you.